Hello everyone, my name is Nomis and welcome back to Starbound. We are picking up here with Ivera Thistlewood, our hero, our hero character for uh, this series. And uh, we are picking up where we last left off. Last episode we kind of got the introduction to some of the mechanics in the game. And uh, as well we crafted a crafting table up here, a campfire, and a forge. Uh, forge or furnace, what they call it, a stone furnace. Uh, so today we are going to continue on with our journey with uh, Avera and uh, checking out this game, uh, seeing what it all has to offer. And I think I said at the end of the last episode that today we are going to actually delve into the depths of this planet below us, uh, see what kind of ores we can find. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, start doing that. Let's just refresh ourselves on uh, our current quest. Okay, so tutorial number six, tools for the job. I'm going to need better tools if I'm going to survive down there. I should start by making use of a furnace and smelting some copper ore to obtain a copper bar. Okay, so that's what we are going to be doing. Set as current. Let's head on down to the planet, guys, on our teleportation pad. Here we go, and it is nighttime again, so we will get our flashlight out. And I think we're gonna look for. Uh, gather some cobblestone. Some more cobblestone here. Let's just mine all this stuff, I think. Uh, so we can actually build a, a decent pickaxe. So R gets our matter manipulator out. Pick up some of this cobblestone. Here, let's, let's put down a torch too, just so you guys can see what's going on. There we go. Much better, hey? Okay, so I'm not sure, I can't remember if we need the crafting bench to make a uh, tool. Probably do. Yeah, it looks like we do. So we'll just grab a bit more cobblestone here. Take some off the back wall. And we're going to beam up to our ship again. Let's see if this is going to be enough to make ourselves a uh, proper pickaxe. Okay, and daylight's coming. Let's take our torch back. Hop back up to the ship. Okay, let's hop up to our crafting table. And go over to our tools. These are all the tools we can make. Oh, can we not make? Maybe we can't make a uh, pickaxe yet. Maybe that has to be unlocked. Okay, I guess it wants us to use... I'm pretty sure we used to be able to make a pickaxe right off the bat. I guess it wants us to use our mana manipulator a little bit longer. Okay. No worries. Let's head down. Find a cave. And we'll start digging down, looking for some ores. We can grab these... Uh, ores right here on the surface first. So we got some coal. Let's grab all this coal and I think we'll just head down into this cave system here. Oh, it doesn't go down very far. It's got some water down there actually. Alright, let's see here. What else? Maybe this one? Okay, torch, eh, not really. Okay, I think these guys are going to be uh, hostile. If I remember from last episode, oh, oh god, <laughs> and I failed. I was hitting the left mouse button when that was our, our right mouse button. So this is, uh, this is alright guys, this is uh, what it looks like when we uh, lose a life. We lost 30% of our pixels. Not a big problem. We didn't have many many to start off with We have been put together again here, and we are back Let's see what we've dropped Actually, we didn't drop anything here. Okay. I thought we were supposed to be dropping our items well, Not a big deal. Yes I thought that's what we uh, had decided on Okay so right mouse button, swing this weapon. Let's 
try down here. Well, this keeps going down. So let's uh, start digging our way down here, maybe. Let's see what there is. Is there anything? Oh, no, I don't want the arrow. I want our torches. Don't want to drown. So I got the dead end, actually. Yeah, nothing there. Alright, let's grab that back. Uh, our... There we go. Might as well grab some more plant fibers. Since they're here. Very good. Maybe we'll just, uh, stay on the surface, see if we can see any copper ore on the surface, or near the surface. We can explore the planet as well. So we got more coal down there. Jeez, they're just wrecking us. Alright, where are our bandages that we made? Let's pull those out. Put those in our hot bar. Move the coal down there. Alright, that's number five. There we go. Get some healing going on here. More coal, lots of coal. We can use coal as a source of fuel. There we go. Source of fuel for our ship. There's a lot of these guys. Take another bandage. So if we got some more uh, pearl peas and seeds. Okay, I wonder if there's anything down here. No, it doesn't look like it. Oh, don't want that. I'm gonna grab that torch back. There we go. We don't have many to start off with, so let's try our other weapon. Uh, let's try this one. Got a bit more damage to it. A bigger swing. Oh, jump out of the hole. Lots of coal. Some mobs will be friendly, like that guy. He's not going to attack us. And some mobs are hostile. Jeez, there's nothing in these crates. Oh, we're finding. Switch back to this weapon. Let's check out what this uh, thing is here. So this actually uh, makes us glow, so it's easier to see in the dark. So that's kind of cool. Like this guy's glowing too. <laughs> Alright, moving on. Okay, getting our pixels from these mobs. Okay, we picked up a blue petal and a red petal. And another red petal. Can use that in dying. Stuff, uh, some plant fiber, wheat, uh, wheat seeds. Let's check out down here. Oh, the night is falling. Oh, maybe it'd be worth going down there. What do you think? Let's see if we can get down there. It looks like it might go down a ways. There we go. Oh god. Oh god. Get our weapon out. <laughs> a little bit. There we go. Heal up again. Nope. No copper ore that I can see. 
Got our bow that we could use as well, I guess. Forgot about that. Oh, what was that? Got a flare from that one. Cool. Wonder how long this glow dust is gonna last. Oh, horrible aim. There we go. Oh, that guy is coming after us now too. Come on. Oh god. There are also different levels of planets. Wow, I suck. There we go. Uh, so higher level planets will have harder mobs on them. This one's just a... A starter planet. And uh, mobs will get stronger during the night. Nothing over there. We pick up there some raw poultry. Not seeing much for copper ores, guys. Get those pixels. Some mobs will tackle you, some will... Uh, some potato there. Looks like some corn here. Another chest. There's nothing in it. Got another one of these. Oh, does this make us faster? Oh, makes us lighter so we can jump higher. Nice. So high. Alright, let's just run away from this guy. Oh, there's another chest. Nothing in it. Some more seeds. Oh, we lost our, our light. Well, that goes down a ways. Looks like some coal down there. Usually there's some uh, ores on the surface, especially copper. It's a pretty low uh, level ore. Oh, <laughs> I tried to jump over him. Just gonna ignore these guys. Until we find some copper. So this is a forest planet. We'll have, we can have swamps, we can have deserts. Uh, deserts are actually really good for finding materials. Actually, we could probably just jump over this, couldn't we? Oh, no, ran out. Alright, we'll have to mine through the wall here. Put up a torch. Oh, we actually found something. Some steel hunting spears. Cool. Let's put that up there. Move some of this... These items down that we don't really need in our hotbar. Uh, that can come down. Let's move the flares over here. Let's try that. Hiya! more wheat. All I'm seeing here is coal on the surface. I suppose we could get enough coal to uh, maybe take off and go to another world. Might be a possibility. A couple chests here. Here we go. Starting to find some stuff now. A rickety beater. 64 DPS. So that's a little slow, we'll take it. Not sure how it compares to these. That's pretty slow. Some corn, some wheat. There's some copper ore. There we go. 
We've got 12 copper ore that we've found in these crates. That's good. Some more bandages. Let's put that up here. Move these items down into our inventory. And we got a poor spear. 56. Might be a bit better than this one that we have. It's two handed. And 45. Let's switch that out with this one. And that's a two handed. We'll take that as well. Alright, let's try this out. Uh, what do I want to do here? What's going on? Uh, I'm so confused. Well, I'll figure that out later. Stick with this weapon, I guess. So this might be enough copper for us. Let's just uh, walk a little bit further. Eventually we will make a full circle. of pixel things down here and uh oh what do we got down here oh looks like there might be a bit of a base down there so let's uh let's try and get down there uh, we'll put a torch up here and we'll dig i think there's a ladder there too we might be able to climb down as long as we don't break it. Oh, and we did. Oh well. I assume that's a little bit of a mini boss there. Take the pixels from there. Nothing in these crates really, some platforms. Uh, but this box, some more cobblestone. All right. Oh yeah, he's gonna fight. Alright. That wasn't as hard as I thought it was gonna be. What about this guy? Yeah, he wants to fight. Oh god. Okay. Well, that's a big fish down there. Alright, buddy, come back, yeah. Hi yeah. Ah, okay, so now that we're quite injured here, I'll just show you another thing. When you rest, you'll also regain some health. So we can sleep in these tents down here that someone has left. This looks like a little bit of a, maybe a mining operation or something. Uh, you will find random uh, locations, like NPC locations in the worlds, both above ground and underground, depending on what planet you're on. Uh, there are dungeons that you can look for. Alright, let's just use our bandage, speed this up a bit. We can cook up uh, our food here, might as well. Okay, excellent. Check out these, some more copper. Uh, some oil lanterns. More platforms. Oh, here we go. A silver pickaxe. Nice. So let's throw that up uh, there. We'll take the flares down. Oh, and here comes this guy. Hiya. Hiya. We're so jumpy. There we go. Ten pixels. So we will definitely use that uh, silver pickaxe. That's actually an upgrade of a couple times. I think it goes cobblestone pickaxe uh, to copper to silver. Some iron ore. Add that to our stash. Some more planks. Some climbing rope. One use, but a useful way to use it. Use it. So if we get uh, stuck somewhere, we can climb our way out. That's good. Let's close that. And head on down 
here. We'll just use our flashlight. Okay, let's hop up. Some more copper. That's what we just looked at. Those pixels. We got some uh, construction lights up here. We'll probably take those. So that might be nice to have for a base if we ever set one up. We'll just search this stuff first. Uh, you can also just shift click. I forgot about that, but that's an easy way to just bring items over into your inventory. E will turn it on and off the lights. Uh-oh. 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 Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> I got stuck in there. Alright, so we lost uh, some of the stuff that we picked up there, unfortunately. We'll have to run back and try and grab that stuff. Reform here. And what all did we lose? Uh, all our copper. Nice. Everything that we needed. Okay, well, let's beam back down. And I will hustle over there. I might uh, just run the opposite way, see if that's a bit quicker. So we'll come back uh, once we've found that location again, guys. Oh, actually, we found another campsite here. And uh, this looks like it might be... Uh, that location we were at. Let's see. It looks like a pretty big establishment. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> Don't want to get lost down here. Uh, where's our... Bandages. So this, I'm pretty sure this is the same uh, set of caves. Oh god. There we go, take care of that guy. Alright, let's hop up. Let's find out where the place we were at was. Looks pretty extensive down here. Oh, this was it right here. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Nothing lost. Fantastic. We'll put a light there. Alright, let's finish looting this area. And uh, we were pretty close to making oops, our way around the entire island. Or the entire uh, world, I should say. Controls are a little bit different from the last time I played, so... Forgive me if I... Uh, bumble around a bit. I'm gonna take that with us. Let's check out these. Oh, down here. If I can get up. Maybe we can find some more copper. Take that lantern. There is fall damage, obviously. campsite and just down here oh what is this a throwing block a block you can throw okay and another weapon a poor cutter 44 and 1.21 swing speed well let's quickly loot uh, the rest of this camp and then we should head up and finish this quest that we're on so we're getting near what will be the end of the episode. Let's search all this stuff. More torches, fantastic. More copper. Is there something else down there? Take that. Pixels, planks.
copper. Climbing rope, pixels, another silver pickaxe. Awesome. So we got two of those. It's down here. Well, maybe we should come back and search the rest of this. I don't know, this is pretty extensive. So let's, uh, let's head back up to our ship. We'll smelt this ore that we've found so far. We will come back next episode to finish looting this uh, camp that we found. And we'll just finish off this... Uh, here, actually, we can put down some... There, let's do this. Let's find, make some places for some chests. Let's do it like this. One there, one there. Put a big one up here so we can start storing all the loot that we're going to find out in the world. Okay, so some copper bars. Well, let's make as many as we can. Quest complete. There we go. Nice. I'll need a whole bunch of copper to start building tools. A copper pickaxe will allow me to mine faster for a while. Well, we've already found silver pickaxes. To make use of stronger, more valuable ores, I need an iron anvil. Uh, so that's why we need to make tools. That's right. With an anvil, I can prepare myself for the dangers ahead. I can make one with uh, the crafting table. Let's go ahead and do that then. Take a look here. Gunpowder. Um, anvil, anvil. Iron anvil. So we're going to need eight iron bars. We should be able to... Uh, make enough iron bars, I would think. Yeah, we got 12 here. So we got the iron bars. Let's make ourselves a iron anvil. Fantastic, quest complete. Perfect, now I can craft all sorts of weapons and armor with this iron anvil. I should make myself some better gear before I head into more dangerous space. It's finally time for me to obtain 20 core fragments. I can obtain uh, them deep underground near the planet's core. With those sails, should be able to fix the ship's thrusters. Alright, so we got our task for next episode. Let's throw down uh, this iron anvil. Okay. Get that selected here. We'll just put it right beside our forge. And uh, here's all the stuff we can make with our anvil, guys. We can make some clothing, defector pants, a semicycle, a shield, a bunch of weapons, pickaxes, iron blocks, a hoe for gardening. Very cool. And uh, why not? While we're here, we did pick up this girder. Let's put this girder down. So you, anything you pick up, guys, you can you can place on your ship, uh, in your base, decorate things as, as much as you like or as little as you like. Uh, where are those those lamps, those lights that we found? Let's put those down too. Let's put those over here, and how do we rotate? Let's throw down. Oh, I think it's just depending on which way you're facing. Yeah. All right. Uh, will that fit anywhere? Yeah, we'll put that there. There we go. Got some nice lights for our, our ship here. So that does it for this episode, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. We will pick up next time, going deeper into the core of this planet now that we have proper tools. And we will look for those core fragments so we can get our ship fixed and start exploring the universe of, of worlds that is available to us in Starbound. So leave those comments below, hit that like button, subscribe if you're new, and until next time, I'll talk to you all later.